A 10% tax means that the quantity increases by 10%. This is equivalent to multiplying the quantity by 1.10, that is adding 10% on top of the whole. A 10% discount would mean that we would multiply by 0 0.90. That is, if you have 100% to start and you take away 10%, that means you have 90% retained. It doesn't matter in which order you do this. You could take the $100 and multiply by the 1.10 and then later by the 0 0.90 or vice versa. I'll do it in the former way. Therefore, we have 100 times 1.10 followed by multiplying by 0 0.90. The first product gives us 110, and then multiplying by this, we get $99. I'll say it a different way now without any calculations on the screen. A 10% tax means you add $10 to the original amount, and then a 10% discount means that you take your $110 and take 10% of that, which is $11, and when you take it away, you get 110 minus 11, which is $99. Ultimately, I just want to demonstrate that the answer is not $100 because the 10% up and the 10% down do not neutralize each other.